Thank you so much for joining me as Game Edge, and we are back in the forest in a new update version 0.53, which is uh, just released, and they had to lay on it, of course, but they had a couple of things they were working on, so the brand new update is pretty short and sweet. Um, there's a couple of patch notes here. This uh, this one introduces a new repair hammer, so repair hammer, I uh, did it to test it before one, and one rock, two cloth, I think it's two sticks. Boom. There we go. We got ourselves a repair hammer. So from now on, you cannot repair anything unless you have the repair hammer. So this is actually the main goal right now. You have to, if you want to repair something, you're going to need this repair hammer. So anytime there's a broken, uh, let's say, wall or something, the repair hammer is going to be needed. So that's pretty cool. Uh, we're also going to test out... Uh, <laughs> that sound looks so bad. <laughs> the way he's doing that. I know it looks probably better if you guys are actually hearing something like talk, 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 repair. Um, I am going to do a little walkthrough of this if you guys want to see it. Uh, but I'm going to do a little walkthrough of both bases that are on this map. Uh, we are going to start brand new over so you can say goodbye to this beauty. This massive, massive building. Uh, I'll post this video very shortly. I'll put up a, a farewell to the buildings, both of them. Again, this one took us an arduous amount of time. Should have been done in multiplayer because it really took 70... Well, with the other one, was 78 episodes or 79 episodes. So pretty nuts. Yeah. You know me. I like to build big, but uh, I think that's the last time I built that big. <laughs> uh, I know I've had people say, you know, it's building too big. Other other YouTubers are doing their stuff. So uh, I get it. I, I hear you. But again, I'm not doing creative mode. I'm not cheating my way through it. It's not cheating, but I'm just not using creative mode. And I'm not pretending that that's built. The ones that are actually using creative mode now in their videos are the ones we were cheating before. So, bravo. They've actually had a reason now they can actually do creative mode without looking like a bunch of assholes making Windows, uh, sorry, uh, mod AIs without telling them. And you guys are going, how come I can't build like that? Because it takes a long time. To build like this is a strategy and something you want to build. So, I will digress. That, that lizard just dropped out of the sky, didn't he? All right, let's... <laughs> scary ass lizard uh yeah there's also a couple more things they've also added now the arrows themselves uh will now stick to the enemies so that's gonna be curious to see we can actually get back most of our arrows supposedly and also be able to see their point is that you're gonna be able to see how much damage you've actually dealt to them so you'll see how many arrows actually landed on them and that's supposed to help so let's see if that's true i'll go to the only place i know where i can find these these mutants and cannibals because hell i've not seen it anything much uh since this so that's a re other reason why we're gonna be starting a brand new season right now actually um i'm just gonna test this out before because brand new season means i don't have all these things i don't want to see the arrows on them hey hey, hey 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 just don't move oh right that must have hurt here we go i'm gonna go through the other notes in a second here guys don't move don't move don't move move Oh, right in genitalia. Oh, that one's unlike. Okay, good. How you doing? Are you hiding on me? Aren't you cute? You know I can see you behind that freaking tree, right, brother? Oh, damn. That looks like it went through. I wonder if I get you in the head. That's what I want to do is... Don't move, don't move, don't move. Don't move. You just jiggle too much. That's why I aim for the chest. Now you're scared of this? Hey, buddy. Are you scared? Oh, did I go in the head? Excuse me, I'm not talking to you. That looks like it went all over him, look. I've got arrows all over him, I'm grabbing him off him. <laughs> That's pretty cool, you can actually go up and grab him. There we go, he's down. Does it stick to the lizards too? It does! Alright, that's really cool. Oh, right in the head. Okay, the head doesn't seem to... Oh, yeah! <laughs> Come here. Come here, I'll take it out of your nose. <laughs> Oh my god. Don't move. <laughs> Come here. I'm gonna feel so bad. <laughs> Come here quicker. I wanna see the sunlight. Can you stand here for a second? I know you're probably wondering what the hell's going wrong with me here, brother, but I just wanna see the damn arrow on your nose. The sunlight. I know it must hurt you, but Oh, just stop. Jesus, you're violent. Right, that's enough. Right in the neck this time. Yeah, just stand there and take another one in the head. This is actually a freaking lot of fun. Especially when they just stand there. What the hell is wrong with them? Is this arrow... The bow of superpowers that he gets scared or something? 
Man, I got a couple of headshots in there. That's and then I can actually say I got a couple of headshots. Oh, my armor's starting to go. And uh, the game is afoot. All right, that that went down. Pretty cool. Can get back my arrows. I like that. I like it a lot. All right, well that's really cool. All right, let's start off a brand new season. And again, I'll uh, keep one safe here because I'm gonna be making a tour video. If you guys are interested, just mark it down in the actual comment fields if you want to see that. And then on a tour video, I will make it available for you guys to download, so you're able to download the entire thing. So if you guys want that, and there's enough, you know, enough demand for it, then I'll go ahead and make it. And again, I want to thank you guys. This is a game that started 30k for me. Uh, we're at 30,000 plus subscribers on our channel, and I can't thank you guys about enough uh, for all your support. It really started all off in the forest, and uh, I kind of took a time off for a little bit. And the reason is for um, of the forest because I just got a little bit frustrated watching uh, YouTubers cheat their way through and pretend, and then actually get all the views off it. I just got kind of just you know, it kind of it kind of tinges your mouth a little bit. You know, you, you work so hard. It's like you building a, a massive house, and then the guy next door has some other guy built it, but he tells everybody he built it. You know, it's kind of pissing me off. Anyways, but now I just have to get over it and move forward. So if you guys want to see more of the forest, you need to support it, please. Make sure you put your thumbs up. It's very much needed. Um, again, I, I need to know whether or not you guys want to see more of this. I don't mind making them. I love this game. I've said that many, many times. I love this game. So yes, of course, there's two bases here. There's one over there and one here. So these are the two bases I will be showcasing. And that will be a pretty short video, I guess. But it'll be just a little showcase. And we'll put the download for the actual game. So I'll keep one of the save files here in a lower a lower save slot, and I'll put how you guys can do it. You just have to plop it in. Again, I'm not responsible if it doesn't work properly, but you know it is what it is. And you get to go and you know, tour the entire base and do what you want. Actually, continue building if you actually want to. So that's actually really cool. All right, let's start fresh. Let's do this. I'll be right back. All right, so we're back, and we're gonna test out the. Well, there's nothing really new. But at the same time, we're gonna actually wait here and uh, uh, the comfort. After seeing what happens to him, it kind of freaks you out. Everything will start when I grab that book here. I just want to go through a couple more things that they had in the update. In uh, hardcore mode, they've uh, increased the chances of distorted enemies coming out. And also added new systems and distorted travel in groups. Either the regulars or distorted. So now you have more of those. You have more chances to see them. So that's really cool. Multiplayer has also fixed tons of bugs. Allows you to allow all weapons are now with shared with sharing tray. Oh, cool. So I guess you can put the sharing tray. Oh, cool. Improve animations and other players. And that had a new uh, leather jacket. I think they should remodel the players too. Just a little bit uh, a little bit nicer. I like this guy. I don't know. I, I, it's just a thought. Anyways, cool. Uh, again, don't take it the wrong way, guys. We are starting a brand new season. And then we're going to try in a, a different biome than usual. We'll see where we crash first. And we'll see if we can survive the first few nights. But we are going to be probably going to snow biome. And probably going back to where Fortega was and uh, building there one more time. And uh, yeah, it's somewhere I built before and it is a great place. But in that snow biome, uh, because it had a lot of traffic too. So <laughs> yeah. All right, let's start this up. Let's grab your book and cause your turmoil. Poor kid. After we find out what happens to him. Ooh, that food looks horrible. All right. Hold on, Timmy. Wow, Timmy's head just smashed that front again. Damn. I do not have a safety belt in that kid. And as we found out that, well, if you don't know the story, block yours. You should go back and check it out. All right, we're waking up really strange. We actually crashed. Uh, the actual, well, we crashed the plane. <laughs> but the game actually crashed uh, when it passed the sequence. So I just restarted and pressed the space bar. In case this happens to you, you can actually just press the space bar and we'll get through it. Hopefully the developers will fix that up. Uh, our main goal right now, which we've done it, this is season 18. Holy crap, I think it's season 18. 18 seasons of making buildings. That is, that's remarkable. All right, let's get the list. That was a food, The of course, the alcohol. We can make Molotovs. You could also drink if you really want to. Doesn't really help you that much, though, but yeah, it is useful. 
All right, let's double check. There, nothing here, nothing here. We ate everything. Upskirt on the nur on nurse, on the flights. <laughs> on a stewardess. How you doing? Oh, for a second, I thought she was giving me the finger. Her fingers are burnt. Ooh, damn. Oh, it's nothing new here. Uh, this is actually a really good location for us to be, because uh, yeah, look at that. It's perfectly placed. You can just hop back in and out of this thing, and this is <laughs> like a cheat almost. That food will constantly come back, so I guess some people who can want to do that, they can actually live off this thing. And it's perfect, All right? These are blueberries now. These are regular berries. All right, main goal right now. Let's get going. Let's waste some time. We'll pick up rocks, sticks. We've got lots to do. Rabbits. Uh, God. Weapons. Hammers. A whole lot of stuff. Let's get going. And, of course, suitcases. That will be really good if we can find some. There you go. Awesome. Now, generally, you don't see the mutants or cannibals for a little period of time. You have, like, a buffer area here. You shouldn't see them for a little bit. They shouldn't appear. Um, unless you go to their village, I think that's the only time I've ever seen them just pop up afterwards. Now, it doesn't mean that's not you know, still the case. But, again, as a new season, we'll be able to check out anything new that they've done. Of course, we're going to have to grab every little bit we can. We're grabbing watches. Uh, of course, wow, it's so empty. I always forget how empty it looks. It hurts right here. No, I actually like starting over. I always love it. I hope to God you guys are uh, going to be enjoying this. We're going to try something a little different. Well, not different, really. We're going to put snow biome. I know a lot of you have been asking me to go back. And we're going to go back. I know we, we built a lot in this biome. And uh, Fortega was probably the most favorite of our builds. We built on that lake a long time ago, many seasons ago. Uh, we're actually going to be grabbing two sticks here, making a weak spear right away. I have so much cloth. I have 22. Was it... Was the uh, club again? I forget what the... Oh, I think it was with the uh, skulls, isn't it? Yeah, burning rock. Yeah, okay, no. We don't need that. It's funny how you, you play this game so much, but then you don't craft these things all that often, and you realize, oh my god, I don't remember everything. Until you start going, oh, there we go. That's what I want to see. Here, little rabbits. Maybe be your worst nightmare for the first time here. Welcome me to this. Oh, wow. Now, I did try hardcore mode, and I tried to run a series on it. I see many of you really enjoyed the thrill of uh, being attacked all the time, and I think that's actually something that, you know, it's more of a building, crafting game. I've had a lot of rapport of that. I do enjoy it. I still play the hardcore mode on the side, um, just because I, it keeps me going. I, just, I love this game profusely, so yes. That's why I find that second rabbit. I just saw him pour it out of here. I lost him. Anyways, we're going to have to run out anyways. We're not going to waste too much of our time here. Uh, because at the end of the day, we're going to have to get ourselves somewhere situated. Now, is that cannibal already? I, I hope I, it's not what I saw that early on. Maybe it was just suitcases and stuff. There we go. The spear definitely is a good tool to start off with. It, uh, especially if you want to get yourself some animals and stuff. Now, you see we're bloody, so it starts off really bad. We have to make sure we... We heal ourselves. You can actually use rocks to hurt animals to, or you know, knock them out, and then take their fur. And of course, we need as much cloth as possible, so we're going to take all the suitcases we possibly can find, at least. <laughs> oh wow, that thing just whipped at us! All right, let's find out the exact location we're at. I'll know by the uh, beach front here. We always see the lander on the same area, I think. Beautiful. Well, we got some meds at least. I think max we can carry is five anyways now, so... They cut down on those things. That, I did not enjoy it. I still don't enjoy it. Not a big fan of that. Alright, we're pretty far... Oh, actually, we're not that far away. And usually there's some stuff coming down here. We can pick up some... Uh, some aloe and stuff usually around here so we'll be lucky if we can find some around these trees that's a killing tree here okay reason why i always call this killing tree or healing tree people call it they initially they used to have bodies hanging from these things 
and then it just disappeared. I don't know what happened. They decided to take it away. They had a hard time, I think, putting it into the game, or it caused lag, possibly. I don't know, but it's definitely... Uh, so you wonder where that scribble is? You just, you just open up the B button, and then you just go onto the actual page here, and you can see it's going to give you tons of stuff here to look at. So find Timmy with the do list, set up camp, and then you're going to go through all these plants here. You're going to be, be able to pick up, and every one of these plants will give you a little scribble like we should have had one already, shouldn't we? There it is, marigold. So marigold's been checked off as a plant we find. Will that be something for the end game? I don't know. Maybe it'll give you uh, achievements and stuff if you find each and every one of each page. That is very, very possible. I do not know. The developers don't really talk about those things. And pretty much you only hear about them in the updates, but they work really damn hard. So I will give them kudos. Now I'm just going around to make sure I can grab as much stuff as I can. I was hoping they would have turned. There we go, some blueberries. I wish I had a little more fur. We'll take it for water right now kind of hungry and thirsty well more thirsty than anything else all right some more aloe we're not going to throw that away we need that we also need one now just to make sure we stay healthy because we are full of blood there's a chance of infection and if you're wondering where that is you just press a b button here go to your main index and it should be where is it again here there we go dabs always confuse me so day survive here currently feeling good and that it doesn't actually doesn't say we're covered in blood that's kind of odd huh athleticism and not these are kind of oh i see you little son of a bitch athleticism and all that are things that are not properly done in the game that really uh can give you benefits of course that you can run a little longer i just saw him little son of a bitch. there's some more aloe aloe pick as much as you can you can fit in your inventory Again, all this is going to be useful as we go through here, through this game. Uh, we'll be able to get some cloth here. I'm going to take advantage of this and then head back for some more aloe. Uh, let's get some cloth here too. These things are a great resources for alcohol, cloth, uh, bones. So you can get skulls like this. <laughs> that thing just scared the shit out of me. No, you, you can't escape anymore. But I can use your armor and your as food. Yeah, food is good. And if you wanted to get another check mark on your book, we picked up a lizard head. Pick up the heads of the bodies of the of them, and there you go. All right, we've got another snack collected, which is nice. There are some random stuff you can find. Also, oh, that little rabbit is son of a bitch. Let's come back for the cloth in a second. Just really need a rabbit cloth. Did you just change? Son of... God, I hate rabbits. I mean, not in real life, but I just... When we're playing games, it irritates the shit out of me. Especially when you're friggin' exhausted like this already. Oh, God damn it. Yeah, let's just fix that. I should build a spear that. And the tennis balls. You can actually light those on fire and actually use them as a weapon if you want to. They will hurt you at the same time, though. There's uh, nothing right now that really... Like, you know, gives you, like, some kind of reprieve. You can actually use that just to throw them, but... Another marigold collected. More cloth. Alcohol and, of course, a skull. I'll take those. I'm not going to say no. And, again, a little more cloth over here. Now, again, cloth, you can make rope out of it. And there's tons of stuff you can use for it. So, again, burning on your axe and using it as a weapon. So, very handy. I do like to find myself at least one place... A local, we can't carry any more of those, so. A local area where you can actually go through, like a little village like this, and grab all the stuff. And as you can see, I went through the village, and there's nothing here, so. That is actually just perfect. So they definitely have a buffer out now. A full buffer to protect you. Now, it doesn't mean your game is going to have that, so don't get mad at me if it's true. If it's not true, but. All right, we'll pick up the circuit boards. Those are going to be used for bombs later on. Come here, little rabbit. I don't know where he is now. When he goes through that brush, I, I, I lose him every time. Aloe. 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 Son of a bitch. Stop tricking me! Oh, I should have speared him. I should have just thrown a damn spear. Ah, oh, just to the right. I left, sorry. Oh. Whoa! 
I think I got him. I, I did. Now, tell me that was not a good toss. That was spectacular. Here we go. Picked up a rabbit's head. Drop that. That's gross. And we're full of blood already. Jesus, man. You didn't say spread on you. Just need one more to make yourself a little pouch. We're going to get a berry pouch on our way back. And it's so important. Uh, I was hoping he's going to go left. That rabbit just popped in. That rabbit just died. I'm telling you right now, get him. Get him while you can. Um, it's only two needed? Oh, I thought it was more than that. Uh, as you can see, we need it for quivers and stuff too. So as you go here, rabbit. Uh, also, again, rabbit fur boots will keep you nice and warm, which we're going to need also. We all go to need it. All right, we can actually take a little more aloe and actually make ourselves some meds. While we're in an area that actually has this stuff, might as well get ourselves primed up and ready to go. So you take one aloe and one marigold, and bam, you got that. And there you go. Now you got plus meds because we've added ourselves cone flowers. Now I don't have very many cone flowers, but plus meds are different. How? Well, there we go. Um, they give you a little more boost than regular. So you get plus meds, you'll get a little more boost, almost full. I think it's 100%. And the other one's about 50%, if I'm not mistaken, or less. Oh, this is good. You only have a max of five, so. That was pretty, uh, that was a little early for me to toss that. I don't see you. Oh, you son of a. Oof. And rabbits are, actually, they're pretty, of, you can get them actually over there. We can actually get them in uh, the snow biome. It's not like it's desperate. Okay, let's get going. Let's sit here for hours. At least we got ourselves a berry pouch. That's what really mattered. And of course, I would like to get some armor because we don't see those guys very often. Sorry, brother. I have to go downhill from the snow biome to actually get you. You're going to be useful. You also get the birds for feathers. And he's looking himself. Yeah, I know I need to wash. I'm quite aware. Um, I think we should be okay now. Let's move ourselves out. I get to remind myself that, well, of course, there's not one berry here anywhere. Not at, they're good berries. No, there's different kind of berries. You can use them. The red ones, if you find them inside these things, these are probably the bad ones. You don't even see them. That's kind of odd. Um, here's the blueberry ones. These are the ones you really can eat. These are the only ones you can eat. With a berry pouch, you just hold on a berry pouch and you see now it turns into a pouch. You can just press E and you can collect them. And at the same time, now you're collecting some seeds, which you can actually use for planting. So I know most of you do know this, but we're going to go with this as if you're brand new to this game. Because, I mean, there are some new players, thankfully, that are getting involved and they are going to start growing because this game is so much fun. It has really a lot to offer. All right, I think that's all. Usually, blueberry plants, you find two or three a shot. Uh, we could start seeing mutants around this time. I think the time frame is there. We've got to look out for the time that's going to be. More aloe vera. I thought I just heard something. That's a crackling. They added so many noises to this game that it becomes, uh, it becomes immensely beautiful to listen to but it's also scary now i did miss a stupid thing stupid me i, I went and i missed uh stopping at the boat over there which i think maybe we we'll have to go back and pick up at least the rope and stuff we can always come back my guys marigolds let's cage you safe for days i think i saw a cannibal now man the psyche man it's playing they're playing tricks on me Yeah, I did see it. I did see it. How you doing, brother? I missed you by that much. Oh, don't tell me I lost it, though. I lost it. All right. I don't have my katana, which I should have gone and picked up right away. Actually, we're going to go and do that. I keep on forgetting that's going to be a must. Now we're going to try to avoid too many fights here. Just because uh, we're not exactly in a position of protecting ourselves too much. But it's nice to see the guys around here. 
They're out and about. Okay, so two katana we go. Damn it, that was a slow ass rabbit too. Our guy's so damn out of shape right now. For a guy who's supposedly a survivalist of a TV show, he sure sucks at this. <sighs> that breathing irritates the crap out of me. Because it means, Game Edge, you can't go any further, man. You can't do it. Alright, we gotta get going to that katana. I think we're gonna take a katana and probably have to head back to the boat and sleep there tonight. And then head out to the snow biome. Where are we gonna be building a base? I guess it's all up to you guys. If you guys wanna see this series, you wanna continue seeing it. I mean, we're going on season 18. I know it's been a long series. and uh, But again, I'm having so much fun with this. And I know a lot of you enjoy this. And maybe a fresh start is what we need. The other base build was a little bit too big. Um, I'm 110% agreeance with it. We're gonna pick up those uh, beautiful blue flowers. Those are actually gonna help us out quite a bit. Now those ones are actually gonna give us a lot of energy mix, which we need. So energy mix is these two together. So we don't have very many cold flowers, but we do have some chicory, which is nice. These ones I think are full, yeah. The variants of flowers all depend on loads. Um, sometimes, like now, this is actually probably the best variants I've seen overall maybe they fixed that maybe they fixed that it seems to be a lot more of a spread here which is really nice that makes it a lot more fair especially if we have less around we should be able to find the flowers easier well easier how about that not too easy all right we're gonna go straight and pick up the uh we're back to the friggin arana we're heading for the katana and actually, the katana is right across. We should have stopped at the boat there. The katana is actually right across from uh, where we want to stay. And we do need to get some leaves and stuff. So as we're going through bushes, let's knock this around. We don't need more sticks. Okay, that's good to know. The leaves are going to be used. Now, again, leaves are 45. That's enough to make one shelter. So that's not enough to fires and stuff. So you really need to work on that. Uh, these little plants and all that stuff will regrow, so it's not a big problem. I'm exhausted. Pure exhaustion all the time, this guy. Let's see if we're going to actually get there on time. There we go, some food. These ones are good. These are the brownish ones. Everybody's saying orange, but the orange ones are very bright orange ones. Those are no good. These ones are phenomenal. Give you a little bit of a kick. Down she goes. Now, that's on a regular spear, so, you know, upgraded spears are great. They're meant really for bigger mutants. You know, should put Molotovs on those, but we'll go through all that process. We'll pick up the head just so we can mark it off in a book, and we'll drop that right away. You only need to do that once. Now, it's going to start getting dark here, so... Should be interesting. We'll probably make a shelter outside of the Katana Cave. Yeah, I know I'm covered in blood infection, but at this point, we're just starting off. It's not going to be a big deal. Oh, there is a... Uh... I just wanted to build on the side, but it's so damn difficult. Actually, we built here. Not too... Oh, I was saying, we built here. We built here multiplayer, didn't we? Yeah, the village is right here. It's getting dark. And the cannibals are out, and they're more rambunctious at night so i mean i don't think there'll be a whole lot to start off with but they might start coming out at us all right i'm gonna turn on lighter as much as some people get annoyed by it, it generates light and gives me a chance to when i'm rendering to show you guys uh, what we're doing there we are we are actually there right now got some rope which we desperately need there we go this is actually where we built our hut yeah this is right in the village. Beautiful. Just what we need. More berries. Keep us alive. Nice and healthy. Usually three bushes like this. There's in one, two. Hopefully that's fixed too, because that was really hard to take care of. Alright, you know what? Just for you guys to see better, because it's been dark for quite a bit of time. Let's do options here, and what we're going to do is um, 
M131. This usually looks a lot better for videos. Makes it a lot easier. Let's get rid of that pouch. Just make sure we got something to protect yourself with. We should be pretty close to the katana now. Village was there, so we should be right over here. Tree, tree. This is where these guys start popping out now. I can feel it in my bones. Uh, here's some more cloth. I can't, just can't say no. Not that's really on to cloth. We are in a village, right? Yeah. We are. Now this is a primary one. There should be a secondary one back here with red paint, which would actually protect us. So on our way back, maybe we'll grab that. I think we need it right now. Because I'm going to have to wash off this blood anyways. All right, let's go directly to... Oh. Let's get right there. Come on, what's going on? Man, can you always be exhausted? It's so fucking annoying. I need to cook up some food. I need to get a campfire going. I need to get the blood off us. <laughs> There's so much we need to do here. All right, we're right around the corner here. I didn't drop the spear, did I? Good. Yeah, that panting goes away after we get ourselves going with logs and stuff. Once you start building one of the problem, the reason why I'm probably more quiet than usual is because when I first start, I'm listening out for those darn cannibals. And they are very, very, very dangerous. And there's one right now. All right. Spear her to death. That takes longer than I really want to spend. We're going to go down to caves. Oh, shoot. I need to get the axe. At least I can protect myself a little bit. Stop hitting me. Now I'm getting lost when you do that. Scratched off something here, but uh, where are we going? Just two rocks. I need to go down here and check out where we're at. Oh, there's a the two rocks. Okay. Now, I'm probably not killing them. You're wondering why? It's because we're, we're, we, no, we have no energy right now. Why bother? Why waste your time when you have to go to caves and come back out with a katana? All right, a katana. Then you're so much happier. Now you hold the shift down by pressing downwards and you'll just be sliding down really quick. It really does make a difference. I regenerate energy when I'm doing this. It's kind of weird. I'm not climbing upwards. There we go. It seems like we're going down a little slower than usual. The day changes up. Or is that dragging sound again? That cloth is everywhere. Pick that up. It's like gold, I swear to God. Gold, gold, gold. We have too much skulls. Uh, here's one of Timmy's toys. We have to put those together at the end. The last cutscene of uh, when he finds Timmy. You'll see that. And of course, two paintings, which you can put on walls. If you're not always aware of that already. Most of you are, I know. And make our way up here. Let's just get the katana really quick. That's the most important thing right now. Oh, man. That's Armsy in there. Oh, damn. He's one hell of a mutant. <laughs> We've killed them quite a few times. Now, usually doesn't follow me out here, but that did sound like something was running after us there for a second. It kind of freaked me out. Uh, crouch by control. And we'll come out here. Beautiful. Actually, we'll drop in... Uh, press R. We'll drop on a lizard in there. Start cooking her up. And we'll take his watch, which we can't take any more of. I have no change. This is very useful. We can actually use this for fire, so the more the merrier. Not useful for anything else. 
Uh, more Axe Pills. We don't need any. Hey, I'll pop one. So it's just so much. There's also free food here. So I really need to cook a lizard, I know, but... Eh. I just can't help but to pick up everything. Anyways. And a katana should be... Did I pick it up already? Oh, I did. It was on the floor here near this guy. That is awesome. Alright, let's go get the flashlight. Which is just down here. And some colas right there too. Excellent. There we go. The two lawyers. And our flashlight is in there too. So now we have got the flash. Do we have a flashlight? Oh, there it is. Okay, good, yeah. Plastic torch. Cool. Let's make sure we drink some colas. Got a whole bunch here. Now they do fly everywhere still. All right. That's something they need to work on big time. Can't carry more sodas. Too bad. We could actually use it. I bring one of those crates with us and run back. We should be allowed to do that. Okay, we'll eat this up. Pick up the last bit of booze. And I think we're good to go. Get more circuitry now. It's too bad we can't sleep here or do anything, but we're stuck here. We're going to start going outside and create a shelter really quick. And we should be just fine. There's enough sticks in this woods right behind us to get us up and running. So the main goal is just do that. We'll sleep overnight inside the actual shelter. And the next day, the next video, we're going to get ourselves going. I wish I could grab you too. Oh. I'd love to get that little... These things here, these little Coleman tow torches and stuff. He's pissed off. Oh. We're not in any shape, way, shape or form to fight all this. Oh, shit. Okay. I thought I was thrown off by one of them, but no. And we're going to climb out of this cave. We're going to be still nighttime. We didn't spend that much time down here, so that's okay. And we are still full of blood, so that is definitely going to be an issue. But we'll have to struggle for night. We do have, of course, the proper stuff to take care of of aloe. We can actually chuck one of those afterwards once we say we're infected for some reason. We'll make sure it's all good to go. It's a long climb, but it's better than being in Armsy's grasp, so let's get the hell out of here. And there's no way of sleeping down there. It's too bad. There we go. Up you go. Not now, brother. Huh? Katana's back. Hello, sir. Yeah, the number one priority is that. Katana. I don't care what you do. You have to go and get the katana. Uh, we have two first. Just need one more. I think for the boots. Which we're going to need because it's awfully cold over there and you have to have those boots on. And supposedly the boots also give you like a ninja factor. Reduces the amount of uh, sound you make. But uh, I don't know. I've never seen that or never experienced it. All right, let's make ourselves a shelter right about here. Sounds like a plan to me. We are infected. Eat some mallow. Uh, we will take care of that in a second. Don't worry about it. Uh, but, 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 but shelter and right here. So just in case I went that really quick. So it's going to take 14 sticks and 26 leaves. So let's get that going. We have enough leaves, that's for sure. Sticks, we can grab a whole bunch here. It's two by shots on these ones. More leaves. Beautiful. You also need pouches and stuff. All the pouches we can make with deer skin a lot. We're going to need a whole bunch of pouches, including water pouches. And there we go. That is perfect. All right, guys, we're going to leave the episode here. So we've done what we've done. We've done pretty good. So pretty cool update. We changed the way we're doing things. We're going to be running towards the snow biome and getting ourselves all prim and proper and perfect. So yeah, hopefully we'll be okay. So thank you so much for being here again. Again, if you enjoyed this and you want to be, see more of the series, don't forget to thumbs up. And don't forget to also mention if you want in there, um, if you want to see a tour of the base or end of tour kind of episode, a smaller episode just to see the tour of the base and then a giveaway of the actual base on the same file you can plop into your own. So again, thank you so much for being here. This is the Edge for Game Edge. I'll catch you guys on the flip side.